how did you get in here? Are you dumb? Only when I see a pretty lady. Are you stupid? You barge into my house and you have the F1 tree to flirt with me? You know that's very rude. No, what is rude is you barging into someone else's apartment without permission. I can actually sue you for this. Unfortunately, you can't because the landlord sent me to fix the sockets that you complained were faulty. What happened to ringing the doorbell and waiting for permission before coming in? What also happened to locking your doors properly? Excuse me? You know what? Get your sorry self out of my house this minute. With all pleasure because I'd rather be anywhere else than to be in front of a disgusting thing. Did you just call me disgusting? Wait. You have problems hearing too? Jesus Christ, oh my God. It's your father and your mother that are disgusting. Idiot. Bloody thief. You think I don't know you came here to steal? You have failed because there is there are cameras everywhere. Coward. That's how they go around people's houses stealing. Thief. Is that because you call me? Put on that fire, you. Nonsense. You pretty ladies. Nice to meet you too. Wait, excuse me. The divorcee in there, is that your flatmate too? Why <laughs> you Yeah, because she has so much temper. Very, very, very nasty attitude. Okay, look. Mimi isn't a divorcee. I'm sure you must have triggered her negative side. I am sure you think different when you meet her again. Nah, I don't want to meet her the next time. I'm glad I met you girls, okay? <laughs> I'm sure she's not that bad. No, she's very bad. <laughs> you have a nice day, pretty ladies. Right. Nice to meet you again. Nice to meet you once again. All right. Enjoy the pretty lady. Bye. So fine. Bye. On his way out. Can you imagine that fool barging through this house without telling anybody? And then I was coming down in a towel to pick up my phone. He was just there staring at the wall like a big fool that he is. Now I see why he called you a bitter divorcee. <laughs> Did he what? Yes. Yes. He said you're a divorcee because you're always angry. His generation. His 15th generation that are all angry divorcees. Can you imagine that fool? I don't blame him. Is that stupid landlord I blame? Because if he had called to let us know that that idiot was coming, this wouldn't have happened. Not to worry. I will treat him. You see, he's fuck up. I will treat it. Oh, sorry. Calm down. Hey. Now, wasn't that a bit too much? I think I can now see reasons with him. <laughs> I don't hear you all. Oh, my God. <laughs> That butterfly that thinks himself a bird. Oh, the electrician. Look, I don't care who he is or why he's here. I'm calling the police straight away. Police? For what? Why are you asking me for what? For trespassing, of course. Is this his house? What exactly is he doing here? Is it the landlord sent him like the last time? Then the landlord will have to go bail him from the station. Let me calm down now. This has not really gotten to that. I beg, the money you want to use and open that case. I beg, bring a money. Nicole, stop it. What? It's not funny. What? 
that young man has not really done anything wrong. You know what? Let me go and ask him why he's here. Is that okay with you? His reasons have to be very legit. Otherwise, he'll be spending the night behind bars. Yes, you're not sure. Nicole, right? You remember? Yeah, I do. And um, your friend, Shana. Yeah, she's fine too. She stepped out a while ago. Oh, okay. That's that's great. That's great. Nice to see you. Good to see you too, Freddie. <laughs> um, so what socket are you here to fix this time? <laughs> I wish that was the case. I'm actually your new neighbor. New what? Neighbor. So, uh, I was staying at your landlord's apartment, which he just sold. Okay. And um, he offered to allow me to stay at the space at the back, since it's close to my store. Oh, yeah. Well, welcome to the house oh, again, yeah. family. Thank you so much. I guess I'll see you around. Yeah, see you around, yeah? And extend my regards to Shana when she's back. Sure. All right. Wait, hey, uh, sorry. Um, excuse me. I'm so sorry. Um, I just want a little favor. Please, can I have the schedule for that angry divorcee so our paths never cross? <laughs> yeah. She's, she's very crazy. You're a case, no, baby. Please, if you have a schedule, just let me have it, okay? See All right, thank you. Well, turns out that he's our new neighbor. That's not possible. We have three bedrooms in this house and the three of us already occupy it. There's another space at the back. But apparently, our landlord leased it to Femi, so he'll be staying with us hence. Get used to that. No, no way. There is no way I will live in the same house with that barbarian. It's impossible. You know what? I'm calling the landlord right away. Hell. How is that possible, Mr. Landlord? No, no, no. You don't bring in a new tenant into my house without discussing it with me first. Look, that's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is you should have at least called to inform us that a new human is coming into the compound. Isn't it enough reason to call you? I see. I see you get a lot better to it. So I would like you to share me some rubbish. Mr. He ended the call on me. This uncultured old brain ended the call on me. Mimi. No problem. I know what to do. I know how to deal with his type. This is not necessary. That guy will not stay in this house. He will not. I'd rather have the landlord refund me my money and I get another place. Babe, you just have to calm down. You have to calm down before you do something stupid. Look. We paid for this apartment, not the whole building. So this man has the right to do whatever he wants to do. I totally agree with Shannon. Besides, that guy is a cool dude. You just have to know him first. Are you joking? Get to know who. If I can send away all those guys coming to me with big engines, is it that thwart that cannot even boast of a wheelbarrow nut that I want to get acquainted with? Mimi, can you just calm down? Look, it's okay if you don't want to see this guy or you don't want him in this apartment. It's okay. But the guy as well will just have to stay on his own and avoid seeing you until it's important, okay? There is nothing important that would ever bring that guy to this house. Please. Nothing should ever bring him here. I don't want to ever see him here for any reason whatsoever. Babe, you need to relax. Though. We all paid for this apartment and we have the right to come with our guests. And who says I don't know that? Have I ever had an issue with that? But you see this particular guy? This boy, I don't want to use my eyes to see him in this house. I'm begging the both of you, please. 
rooms. Me, I will just, I will invite him to my room. That's fine. Shanna. Shanna. What? Shanna. You're back. Yes, I am. You asked me. Yes, I did that. Nicole didn't mention it. Nicole, she did not. I guess she must have forgotten. I, I guess so. <laughs> so, you're here to stay with us now? Yes, it looks like it. But I hope you girls will treat me well. I'll try my best. I like the sound of that. Right. Uh, I was uh, actually on my way to get some toiletries. Yeah. I guess I'll see you around then. I'll see you around. Enjoy our neighborhood. Yeah, <laughs> I will. <laughs> to take a closer range of this guy. And this guy is so fine. Look, and with the way his dress is always moving up and down, I can bet my life that this guy is endowed. That's not the same way we spoke earlier too. He's very smooth with his words. And that turns every girl on. See, that guy is a temptation for me in this house. Oh, look, these are the kind of temptation I would gladly fall into. Eh? This guy is fine. Do you know this guy somehow reminds me of Caleb, the guy I met in Bini? Look, that guy was a horse. He rides me for over an hour. I have to tell him to slow down so I can catch my breath. Seriously? Okay. Shana, really? You see, that is a disgraceful woman. I mean, why would a young girl like you be asking a guy to slow down for you to catch your breath? When he should be the one begging you to rest. Hmm. You didn't see this guy or feel this guy. I am telling you that this guy made me feel like what I've never felt before. So what? It's not an excuse. If he cannot last for two hours, then the guy is not for me. For real? Yes. I take my utmost satisfaction very important. It is everything to me. Why do you girls think I don't keep these small boys? Because most of them are just lazy fowls who think that 30 minutes is enough to take me to cloud nine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if he's not hitting it for two hours straight, everything he does becomes irritating to me. Wow, Mimi. I really wish I had your energy sometimes. Maybe I wouldn't have lost Chidi. Because slow sex is everything to him. Oh. Don't worry. I'll give you some tutorials on lasting. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate that. You've always been the lazy horse. Jealousy. Mm. You have no idea who you're talking mm. to. Maybe that you're complaining your one hour. See, you have no idea what this guy carries. Like, yeah. you know? People have energy. Oh. Oh. I beg, I beg. Honestly, I'm not joking. What is it, two hours? Mm. Mm. Oh, it's boring movie. You know, sorry, but that should not matter now. Don't blame me. Don't blame me. I'm expecting someone. No. Come in.
Jealousy. Are you mad? What is this nonsense you just did? I've really tried now. What nonsense tried are you talking about? You have been on me for just 20 minutes and you're breathing like a cow, like you want to die. What is wrong with you, Seth? No, what is wrong with you? 20 minutes is enough for some women to come and be satisfied. Well, I am not some women. If you knew you wouldn't last two hours, why did you come here in the first place? Two what? Two hours. Two hours. An event. Now, where they, is it wedding that we are here to do? And now, an event? An event will they do? Where I go last two hours? Or for what? I beg. Guy. This babe came my door. So he wants to chase that guy out because he couldn't nap for two hours. Mm -hmm. He deserves it. I mean, what is he doing here if he can't get the job done? Well, the girl already said 30 minutes now. Nah. He just said what she said. She said 30 minutes is nothing to her. The guy should work on himself. Uh -uh. 30 minutes is not enough. It's not. Hmm. Hmm. Leave me alone! Get out! Really? Get out of my house! Get out! Get out, lazy bull! Get out! Go away, you can't even do anything! You're a shameless. Get out of my room! You can't do anything! You cannot do anything! 30 minutes, time. 2 minutes, time. Just get out! 3 days, woman! Get out, yes! 3 days, woman! Get out! Yet you want to go out there and tell the whole world that you're with me. Okay, you can never be with me unless you satisfy me first. Idiot, so me this. Get out, get out of this place before I kick you. You're still there? You want me to pour you hot water? Lazy bone. Two seconds, man. What is it? go out today? No. Which means you were inside when your friend was embarrassing yourself. Who? Who else? If not for that arrogant flatmate of yours. She was embarrassing herself thinking she was embarrassing the young man. Come on, I'm sure it wasn't that bad. And Mimi is such a sweet girl. Oh please, there is nothing sweet about that girl. <sighs> okay, enough of my friend. Why don't we talk about you? Tell me about yourself. What about me? Okay, the evening is still calm. Can we just take a walk around the estate while you tell me about yourself? All right. Shall we? Yeah. So, uh, which way?
lost her friends. Was that for me? Out there. Was that for me? I think I hear a dog barking close to me. Did you just refer to me as a dog? Oh, it was you. I thought I heard a dog barking close it's to me. It's your whole generation that are dogs. In fact, you and every member of your family is a mad dog. Look at this Nikon poop. This village champion that missed his way and appeared in Lagos. You think you can insult me? <laughs> well, if we look at our names, Femi and Mimi, uh, we can all tell who actually missed their way to Lagos. Ah, I don't blame you. Is that stupid landlord I blame for bringing an idiot like you into this house? If not, you wouldn't be seeing me, let alone talking to me. I really do not blame you. I will not condescend so low to talking to mannerless girls like you. You are mad. You're very mad. No, come and talk to me now. Come and condescend you and talk to me. Come and talk to your... Come and argue with your fellow woman. Idiot. Idiot. It's your, it's your family that are mannerless. Coward. I don't blame you. I really don't... No, come back now. Come back and argue with me. Come back and exchange words with your fellow woman. Hello, Idiot. Woman rapper. Barking, you know? God go punish you. It's you that is a dog. The dog is Coward. <laughs> Will you get your filthy self out of this place? Look, I refuse your apologies. I'd rather sleep with a mad woman than to apologize to you. Well, you have no reason to sleep with a mad woman because, I mean, you're a madman, so you sleep with mad women unprovoked. Now get the hell out of this place! Look, can you get out of my way? I am here to see Shana. Not a rude, uncut human being like you. And what if I refuse to get out? What are you going to do? Shana! 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 What are you doing? Excuse me. I'm sorry. You know, I want a man who is physically expressive with his feelings, a man who is constantly touching me. Especially if he is obsessed with my body. Well, don't you think you would get tired or irritated at some point? Never. Look, I love my man really obsessed with me. I love it when my man just holds my waist when we walk around. I love it when my man spanks my butt when he passes me. He turns me on. Like, I can literally pull everything I'm wearing and bend for you to do it right there. Ooh. <laughs> well, I heard the spontaneous ones are actually good for you ladies. <laughs> True. <laughs> Wait, what? Why are you guys dying? <laughs> Wait, why are, you, why are you guys shouting? A nun can follow you if you know the right way and the right place to do it. Trust me. Mm -hmm. I swear to God. I was dated this guy who was so good at being spontaneous. Do you know how many times I had to call in sick at work just to have time to spend with him and experience it. Oh. <laughs> Did anybody ask you? Come on, Femi. Anyways, Mimi, please continue with the gist. As I was saying, before I was rudely interrupted, the relationship was so rosy, so sexy, until he had to travel out. I mean, he relocated to the States. Okay. Then I met this other guy, and guess what? What? <laughs> The worst relationship I've ever been in my entire life. It didn't even last a week. The guy was too boring. He couldn't do anything. He didn't know the right places to touch me. Girl, I had to dump his ass. Father was like that greater than being such a man. Exactly what I did. You get. <laughs> Shut up. Nicole, I'll be outside. Why? I'm not comfortable anymore. The air. It's kind of weird. Oh, okay, I'll just come along. Yeah, sure. Okay, uh, let me So, I saw my new best friend, this guy is in two seconds, man. Ah, yes. I mean, I can't mind if I take two sisters there. Yeah. I'm mean, just living my life right now. <laughs> that idiot thinks he can make me look stupid, right? 
I know what to do. I will let him know that I deal with things like him and discard them. Yes, Eric, I need you. I said I'm sorry. I'm sorry, just give me a second chance. Eric, I do not do second chances. I told you this the very day you begged me to accept, accept you and give you a chance. I told you. And when I decided to give you a chance, what did you show me? See, it's not like I'm a weak man. So this is just first, first time excitement, you know? When first impression matters a lot to me. Look, I have too many men, young, fine, way finer men than yourself, begging me in my DM to consider them. So why should I be coming back to you? Why? I see, Mimi, there's this friend of mine that told me that there's this agbo, this herb that I will take. Once I take it and jam you, if I jam you, oh, really? everywhere I go. Baby, you should have told me that. Uh -huh. Come here. Come the behave like say. <laughs> Unfortunately, I will not be the one you'll be testing your haps on. Like I said, I do not do second chances. I will never go back to my vomit. Never. Now get the hell out of my house. So who be the vomit? Is it me or what I will I push you. Get out of my house. Just get out with your weak balls. What's now? What's up? No, now, nah, what's it happen? You be photographer. Why do you look me like that? You won't snap me. Two weak balls men. Look at them. Weak men. It's not good for young people. treat people the way I think they deserve to be treated. And you think he deserves to be treated like that? You just embarrass the young man out there over what? Over something he has no control over? What do you mean he has no control over it? Mimi, hmm. does a man determine when he comes during love making? This is something he has no control over. For the fact that James lasts for two hours and Mike lasts for just two minutes doesn't make Mike less of a man. This is something he has no control over. That is how his system was built. Yeah. I decide the kind of man I want to associate myself with. And I have refused, completely refused, to deal with men that last for only five minutes. What is wrong with you? Mimi, look. <sighs> Mimi, I hope you know that life is beyond sexual performances. I hope you know that. Okay, Mother Mary. I will not have that at the back of my mind in my next life. Look at her. She's a big girl and she does exactly what she wants. Can we just keep it? Please. Coming from someone that cannot even last for five minutes. Oh, you talking want to about shade what? Me. Shade you for what? Is it not the truth? You send me what I don't know. Oh my god. Mimi, what the hell is your problem? Others are doing fake life with cars, houses, and other luxurious stuff. And here you are doing yours with sex. Oh my god, I'm crazy. <laughs> I know I'm crazy. <laughs> Oof. Mm. <laughs> I can't believe this.
are you doing? Not much, just laying down. Oh, that's nice. I'm just bored and then I thought to disturb you. It's a welcomed disturbance. It is? Would you want to come by? You know, I'm just all alone. Yeah, sure. actually very cute. Thank you. It's as cute as the owner. Ah, <laughs> uh, what do I do you anything? No, uh, I'm good. Um, I noticed you're always home. Yeah. Uh, the mall um, where my store is located is actually under renovation, so we just have to wait for them to finish. So I asked you the other day if you had a girlfriend and you just invaded my question. So tell me, do you? I don't really like talking about it because it's not been a cool experience for me. Well, I'm here now. And I promise not to give you a horrible experience, okay? Look, for me. Wait, 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 wait. What are you doing? What do you mean, what am I doing? For me, I like you. Don't you feel the same way about me? We're friends. Friends? Did I tell you I don't have enough friends? For me, I really do like you. And isn't it obvious that I like you? Shana. I, I can't do this with I can't do this with you, okay? I, I like you, but this Femi, me, Femi. Me. Please don't live like that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about that. Femi, look. I'm Just to, to stop! You're dying to hear the gist. And look, Femi was on me and I was just screaming. That dude is a machine. Hey! You can't say that again. <laughs> I knew that guy was a hawk the moment I saw him. A hawk it is. Now I think I know better. Look, that guy is a machine. Oh my god. You can see that again. Look, if women should have a man like Femi. Huh? No woman would cheat. I knew that guy was a hunk the moment I saw him. A hunk he is. <laughs> hey, God. I was just screaming, screaming. And is it big? It's big. Hey! <laughs> 
song. <laughs> Shana. What? Shana. I don't find any catch there. Big fish. Shana the Ashana. I beg you. <laughs> 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 into someone else's apartment without permission. I can actually sue you for this. Unfortunately, you can't because the landlord sent me to fix the sockets that you complained were faulty. What happened to ringing the doorbell and waiting for permission before coming in? What also happened to locking your doors properly? Can you excuse us, please? Yeah. It's all. Um, I want to apologize for yesterday. I did not mean to make you feel less of yourself. See, the thing is, before I do anything, I would like to know or um, be sure of what I feel for the lady. And you think what you feel for me isn't strong enough to go down with me, right? Yes. We barely had a decent conversation. We know little or nothing about each other. It's okay. I understand. Are you sure? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you for understanding. Okay. You go now? Yeah. So will I see you when you go back? Take care. All right, bye. Yes, I just look like um, Do you have something I can use to massage it for you? I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't no, know. Let, let, me, let me just help you out. Okay? Thank you. 
Easy, easy, it hurts. Easy, please. You know I can leave it. And when I do, trust me, by tomorrow it's going to swell. Uh, yeah, do it, but just be You gentle. want me to stop? No, just be gentle, please. It's so painful. <laughs> Easy, please, easy, take it easy. It's be painful. <laughs> I did not know you could be this subtle. Well, I didn't know you could be this kind. I'm not. You're not? So why are you doing this? I'm doing it because if I don't, it will swell. And if it swells, you will take time off work and that means you will continuously be in my face and I can't stand it. I see. I see. Please just be easy. Please be gentle. It's so painful. I have to massage. my step and dislocated my ankle. Oh my god. I'm so sorry about that. It's fine. I'll be fine. Uh -huh. How were you able to drive to the pharmacy? Drive? I didn't drive. Femi came here, massaged my leg and put this bandage on me. Femi? Femi who? Your friend Femi. The guy that lives at the back. Femi, my friend. Yes. Oh my God, he was so helpful today. I need you to thank him for me. That's nice. So how was work? It was good. I'll just go fresh it up, okay? All right. All right. Welcome. All right. Uh, sorry. That's fine. Thank you so much. Hey, pretty. How are you? I'm great. Uh, how are you? I am very well. So, I hear you now fix twisted ankles. <laughs> Look, I was only trying to help. This is someone you couldn't tolerate. Well, that doesn't make me less human. I see. So, how is the ankle? You don't care too. Oh, come on. Every doctor would want to know how his patient is faring. Okay. You have a point. 
Do you mind if I come to your place? My room? Yes, your room. You know, I just got back. I need to go in, freshen up, get something to eat, and then I'd like to spend some time with you, if you don't mind. Okay, that's that's fine. That's fine? Yeah, it's fine. Okay, I'll just go freshen up and then I'll meet you later. All right. You're welcome. You're supposed to be resting. I just came by to say thank you. Oh, well, I see the shoulders are dropping now. <laughs> they were never high. <laughs> I don't think so, but if you say so. Okay. Thank you once again for everything. Come on, it's okay. It's I really good. appreciate it. It's fine. Okay. No, Wait. Good. Um, you want to come in? I mean, if you, if you don't mind. Okay. Sure. Sure. All right, come on. Dude taunts me on without saying a word. Look, in case you don't see me later tonight, please just send me good night via WhatsApp. Do not disturb me. Wait, you're going to see Femi this evening? Yes. Why? Hmm. Is it going to be threesome? Because I would like to come along and make it a foursome. I hear it's awesome. What are you even saying? Please. <laughs> I just saw Mimi enter that apartment before coming into here. Is that here? What are you talking about? What do you mean by what am I talking about? I saw both of them enter the apartment together. You're joking, right? You serious? Please, Pretty. Joel is going back to default <laughs> settings. Okay. But I never thought you could be this engaging. Because you're always angry and venting. Oh, please. That was because of how we met the first time. You were literally standing in the middle of my living room, uninvited. I explained. The landlord sent me. I even tried to make a joke. Well. A lady has to always be on guard. It's good to sometimes drop it. Whatever. I have to go now before my friends start to look for me. That's okay. Please, easy on the ankle. But <laughs> if you should feel any discomfort, just call me. Really? Yeah. That would have been possible only if I have your number. Right. Sorry, let me uh, just put it in. There you go. 
All right. I'll save it as stubborn neighbor. What? <laughs> yes. Really? <laughs> okay. All right. Good night. Oh. Sorry. Yeah. Good night. Nicole is not back from work yet. Um, she is sleeping already. Uh -huh. When did she come back that she's already sleeping? I guess his company was so intriguing that you lost track of time. And what is that supposed to mean? What is your problem exactly? Mimi, why are you trying so hard to be so close to him? Do you want to know if the size of his thing will fill you? Or you want to know if it lasts longer than Eric? Shana! Don't shine me. Where is all of this coming from? Look, Mimi, I know you very well. And one thing I am sure of is you just want to sleep with him and nothing more. Oh. I see. So because you wanted to... Wanted to do what? Huh? Wanted to now do what, Now you mean Mimi? listen to me. I am an adult. I decide whoever I want to be friends with or sleep with. It's none of your business. Likewise, Femi. He's a full grown man, just like every other man out there. And he can choose to do whatever he wants to do. Stay out of people's business. Don't have Just get out. Look at this one. Come and see him now. You want to, you want to see Femi? Nonsense. Pretty? Isn't your nature to call every girl you see pretty? I don't understand. Anyways, good morning. Wait, you did not come by like we planned yesterday. I did, but I noticed you were so engrossed by your supposed enemy. Oh. I didn't want to bug. Come on. You could have at least knocked. She just came to say thank you and I asked her to stay. I see. I'm off to work. Alright, I'll see you later. Is Mimi inside? seen you the whole of today so I decided to check to see if your ankle is not making it difficult for you to walk. No, not at all. I just haven't had any reason to go out. Oh. But how are you today? I'm much better. Thank Good. you. Wow. What's funny? Oh, I just remembered how many times you've chased me uh, or refused me entrance to this apartment. Why do you keep talking about it? I promise, I won't talk about it again. Okay. Okay. But it's crazy though. Ah, uh, you just Another... promised not to talk about it. My bad, my bad, my bad. Okay. What can I offer you? Just water. Just water? Yeah. You sure that's fine? Yeah, well, that's fine. So I'll be right back. Mm. Sorry. It's fine. Thank you. How 
are you? I'm good. You seem to spend a lot of time lately in this apartment. <laughs> what can I say? So who are you here to see this time? Shana or Mimi? Hi, Hi Nicole. Hi, Nicole. Hi, it's Mimi. Hi. How's work? Ah, it's much better. <laughs> Is Shana back yet? No, but I guess she should be back soon. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Thank you once again for helping. Oh, no, come on. It's been nothing. It's okay. <laughs> so, um, how's it feeling now? You're touching it. Oh. Because <laughs> yeah. after touching it, the next thing you tell me is you have to massage it so that it doesn't <laughs> no, swell. No, no, no. I just, I just wanted to, to... Mm -mm. I don't trust you. Okay. It's okay. Yes. I'm sorry. My bad. Thank you so much. It's nothing. I mean, it's the least I could do. <laughs> Thank you. Who was here earlier? Oh, Femi. I met him at the living room with Mimi. I'm sure those two are slowly developing something for each other. To think Mimi hated Femi. I guess she was just pretending after all. I don't think so. Because relationship like this end, the couple always starts with each other on their truth. Oh, to know this is leading to nowhere. This is of no good. Mimi probably just wants to sleep with him and then dump him and mock him just like she does with other men. He's an adult. I'm sure he's able to decipher what he wants and what he doesn't. I was going downstairs and decided to check on you. You good? I'm not good. This doesn't just, it doesn't make sense. She's just, she just wants to use him. going to let this happen. I saw him first and I fell in love with him. She cannot just flaunt her small money and take him away from me. I have to think of something to get them back to being enemies. I have to do that so it will be perfect for me. Think. Think, Shana. <laughs> Obviously. As what? As your girlfriend. The last I checked, we broke up two years ago before I left. Femi, you broke up with me. I did not break up with you. And now I'm here to stay. Please, please. Listen, I don't have time for all your drama this evening. You can't just barge into my house and start calling yourself my girlfriend. What, do you think I, I don't have a life? You think I don't have a girlfriend? Femi. I do not care if you have a girlfriend or not. I am here now, and I am here to stay. Please, please. Please let me know where I should keep my box. I don't have time for this. Hey, hey, hey. Femi, I am tired. Stay there. I'm tired. I want to rest. That's going to be a long journey. Please. Should I use this side? <laughs> talking about. 
involved? She's not my girlfriend. I didn't ask you. But I'm telling you. Don't be like this with me. Why do you feel the need to explain anything to me? Whether she's your girlfriend or not, I really don't care. It's none of my business. It's none of your business, Yes, right? it's none of my business. So... So much for it means nothing to you. Well, I do much worse. With men, I feel nothing for. So this shouldn't deceive you. Go back to your guests. You should be enjoying yourself right now and not explaining nonsense. I am just a loner But I wouldn't give it up for you to see I just need a lover I just need a place for me to be This kind of love I need it but I won't make it obvious Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah This kind of life I'm lonely but I wouldn't make it obvious Ooh So I know that you feel The same thing that I feel I know that you know The same thing that I know We are love for Zara, huh? how long do you intend to stay here for? Are you sending me a already? It's just a question. I don't know, but I intend to stay for as long as possible. That is not happening. You hear me? That is not happening. You can't just show up in my life and expect to be accepted after what happened. What happened was a mistake. You cheated on me with my best friend. It was not my fault. It was your fault. You left me and him alone in the house. What were you expecting? Mom, I've apologized now. An apology has been accepted a long time ago. But we can't be together. Of course we can, Femi. See, I've tried moving on, but it's not working. My body, my soul, my spirit, everything belongs to you. I don't need any of that. Okay? You're leaving first thing tomorrow morning. I'm going nowhere, Femi. Watch me. Really, Femi? Femi? Welcome to our neighborhood. Thank you. I wanted to do that yesterday, but you were too busy with your arrival. So I didn't want to disturb you. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. Um, judging by the way you were too excited to see Femi, I'm sure you haven't seen him in a long time. Um, it's been over two years. Oh, wow. 
Two years is a long time not to see your partner. I know, right? Anyways, my name is Shana and I am a neighbor here and I am famous right now. Nice meeting you. My name is Zara. Nice to meet you, Zara. I'm sure Femi has gone out for his jogging. Oh yeah, he's out for jogging. Nice. Uh, Zara, I have to rush to work. I'm quite late. That's fine. All right? It was nice meeting you. Nice to meet you too. Um, I hope you're enjoying our neighborhood. Yeah, yeah. Bye. <laughs> Bye. I'll see you later. Okay. Where are you going? Where does it look like I'm going to? Work, of course. Look, that ankle is not fully healed, okay? I manage. What? So this is why you are going to send me away? I am not sending you away. I asked you to leave politely. Well, what if that's not what I want? It doesn't matter to me. Well, what if I refuse to leave? You will not like what I'll do to you. Get out! You raised this voice at me. different types of women in this life. So, the first ones will take whatever their partners throws at them because they feel it's their right to. And the second will not tolerate any disrespect from their partner, especially when it has to be with another woman. And I fall in the class of the later. Listen, I see how you look at my man. I do not need a seer to tell me you're interested in my man. But my darling, he's taking as you can see. So stay away from him for your own good. You know, if he's actually taken like you claim, then you wouldn't be wanting another woman to stay away from him. If the man belongs to you, then hold him tight. Okay? And hey, let this be the first and last time you stop me to spew this rubbish. I will not take it. That nitwit, that nikompu had the effrontery to come to me and tell me to leave her man. Can you imagine? Look, babe, you wouldn't really blame her. He is her man. Stop it. I hate it when people use that phrase, like they are married. For crying out loud, they're not even dating. And how would you know that? He told me. And you believe him? Yeah, look, <laughs> I did not believe him. But what if he's right? What if they're actually not dating? Then what is she doing in his house? I don't know. Look, I think we should just let them be. Let them sort themselves out. Oh, Nicole, Nicole, Nicole. I wish it was that easy. What do you mean? Um, Shana? Nicole? I, um, I... I have, um... You what? I... I have... 
love. Fall in love with Fanny. What? I'm not silly. That bitch, that snitch, she didn't just go sleep with him and now she has fallen in love with him. No, that cannot happen. I will make sure she doesn't have anything to do with him no matter what it cost. I saw him first and I was close with him. So if I can have him, she won't either. I will make sure of that. I am just a loner But I wouldn't give it up for you to see I just need a lover I just need a place for me to be This kind of love I need it but I won't make it obvious Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah This kind of life I'm lonely but I wouldn't make it obvious Ooh, ooh. So I know that you feel The same thing that I feel I know that you know The same thing that I know We are love foes we are love foes Oh, we are love foes We are love foes Oh They didn't tell me How to run this race I thought I knew before I went on track But my heart keeps beating In the same direction Oh no, no what could I have done? So I put on pretense To boost my presence So when I'm upset They will feel I belong I put on pretense To boost my presence So when I'm upset They will feel I belong but there is nothing inside of me But I know that you feel The same way that I feel I know that you know The same thing that I know So we are love foes We are love foes Oh, we are love foes We are love foes Femi, step aside. I am not moving an inch until you tell me why you're avoiding I don't owe you explanations for my actions. Well, maybe you don't, but you see this action concerns me, so you have to tell me. Step aside. Then why don't you just tell me? Tell me what? Your visitor confronted me. Zara asked you to stay away from me? Now you know. Fanny, I've known Mimi for many years. I've never seen her feel this way about any man. She's always the one that decides who to be with and who not to be with. And for the very first time, she's so concerned about not being with me. And again, for the first time, she said she might be in love with someone. Mimi, Mimi is in love with me? I am just a loner But I wouldn't give it up for you to see Sir. Sir. I just need a love. Who the hell do you think you are? 
Why would you confront Mimi to tell her to stay away from me? I just need a place for me to oh. be. You're kissing your teeth at me? Okay. Okay. I need it. Femi, what are you doing? Femi, what are you doing? You are leaving my house this minute. I am going nowhere. Hey! Leave my Femi! I'm not going anywhere, oh! I'm not going anywhere! From that day, I saw you on top of Josh. You ceased to be anything but an ordinary girl on the streets. Are you so I've been very civil with you since you came. And I want it to remain that way. So peacefully, get your things and get out of my house. Anyway. Don't leave my house. I have not hit a woman before, but if you dare me, I'll, I'll hit you. Stay away from me! I belong. I put on pretense to boost my presence. So when I'm upset, they will feel I belong. But there is nothing inside of me. But I know that you feel the same way that I feel. You, you're such a heartless girl. You have succeeded in ruining that innocent girl's relationship. I hope you have. I didn't ruin anything. Swear to me. Bimi, swear to me that you didn't make Femi throw her out. And see if you're not going to get an accident on your way to work tomorrow. Uh, swear to me. I don't need to swear to you about anything. Femi is a grown man. He can make his own decisions. Yes, I love him, but I never asked him to throw her out. Just a bloody liar. I hope your conscience judges you. I just hope your conscience judges you. Come on, girls. All this isn't necessary at all. He's an adult and he makes his decision. Exactly. If he decides to send her away, that's his choice. You both shouldn't be arguing this. Come on. I hope your conscience judges you. I just hope you're happy. I am just a loner. But I wouldn't give it up for you to see I just need a lover I just need a place for me to be This kind of Let me call off I, No, no, don't worry, just show me to her Okay, the last room by your left Okay, thank you This kind of life I'm lonely, but I wouldn't make it obvious. Ooh, so I know that you feel the same thing that I feel. I know that you know the same thing that I know. Come in. Hi. Nicole said something and uh, I want to hear it from your mouth. I want to hear it from your mouth. Do you love me? So I put on pretense to boost my presence. I will ask again. Are you in love with me? To boost my presence. So when I'm absent, they will feel I Yes. 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 I love you. But I know that you feel the same way that I feel. I know that you know. I have loved you from the first day I set my eyes on you. Which is why I put out that 
angry attitude as a defense mechanism because I know how much I feel for you and I was just scared that you might not feel the same way for me and I just I just need a lover I just need a place for me to be this kind of love I need it but I won't make it obvious oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. this kind of life I'm lonely but I won't make it obvious Come here. You did this to me. So I know that you feel stupid. The same thing that I feel. I know mm. that you know. The same she thing that you feel. Give me that. Give me that. No! Do you want to hurt yourself? No! Wait. Give me You want to hurt yourself? Stop! Don't touch me. I won't. Stop drinking. Shanna, stop drinking. I'm okay. okay. I'm okay. okay. Then relax. Just relax. It's okay. Huh? Femi. Oh, she just good. took Femi away from me. Another man will come. No, I want Femi. He's taking him. Femi took him away. Just Am I relax. not pretty enough? You are. Just relax. Just, just leave me. Shanna, stop drinking. You will hurt yourself. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm okay. So when I'm upset, it will feel I belong. But there is no thing. Should I get you water? But I know that you feel the same way that I feel. I know that you know. The same thing that I know, so we are love foes. You're disappointed, right? Why? That I was a virgin. Not at all. A little surprised, though. I mean, with all the things you said and did, particularly to that young man. I was only trying to belong. I thought it would be odd if my friends are talking about their sexual escapades and I'm just silent. So I decided to fake being a buddy and and I had to continue just to keep up with the lies. Mm. So, you needed a million lies to cover one lie? Yes. But henceforth, no more lies? No more lies. I'm sorry. It's okay. And, um, look, about Zara. You don't have to tell me about her. The fact that you sent her away because of me is enough reason for me to believe anything you say. I am just a loner. But I wouldn't give it up for you to see. I just need a lover. I just need a place for me to be this kind of love. So, I guess you brought that again. Yes, we are. Um, there is something I'd like to tell you both of you. I... I was a virgin until an I go. What? You both kept 
talking about sex and how it makes one a big babe. I didn't want to feel off, so I started creating my own stories. And Eric, a small thing, the two minutes. There is nothing like that. I paid him for everything he did. <laughs> What is your problem? Why are you touching me? I paid you for a job. Sit and do what I paid you to do. Amy, you're blonde the whole dog. Take it easy, man. Mm. Why is your blood blood like this? Huh? Why they push me like that? See, let me tell you, Mimi, we can still change our mind. Eh? You. You're mad. Something is wrong with you. Did you smoke Colorado before you came here? Are you insane? Do I look like someone you can touch? Who told you that I can't touch you? But who told you that I cannot touch Will you? Will you shut up your mouth or I send you out of my house this minute? Touch you. Touch major people. The major um, people. They touch them. I paid you for a job and I need you to do that job right now. Start morning. Okay. You said? I said start morning. You start. Are you mad? Was I not the one that paid you? When you start touching a woman, is she not supposed to start mourning before a man? Start mourning. You know, even Sabi the thing, they say, can you touch me? So I start, John. Ah. Uh, Naso. Ah. Uh, Naso. What is Naso? Moon? Ah. Uh -uh. Local champion. Ah. Uh, not confirm. Ah. Uh, Naso. Ah, uh, uh, baby. Naso. Now you tell me how oh. take on. Oh. 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 Take it up. Oh, baby. Squat well. Oh, baby. Oh, oh baby. Take it. Louder. Nasu. Nasu. Oh. Nasu. Oh. Bend it, baby. Oh. Bend it. Oh, what did you, what did you come out there? Oh. What did you do that? Oh. Oh, oh. Who did? Oh. Who did? Oh. Hey. 30 minutes and we'll continue. It's best. Hmm? I should give you 30 minutes in my house to do what? So what would I be doing during these 30 minutes? Looking at your ugly face? You can be sleeping now. Because you're so lazy and it disgusts you me. You know the rest. You're very stupid. You, you know the you're rest. You're very stupid. Can't you rest? You're a madman. What is wrong with you? lazy men. Something is really wrong with your brain. What? what, what, what I'm not what, what, telling what, what, that I hate, I hate lazy men. Am I a carpenter? You're a lazy man. Nothing, nothing, you're a lazy man. Get out of am my house. Get out of my house. I'm a lazy man. Stand up. Stand up. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Stand up. Get out of my house. Get out. Get out, lazy bull. Get out! Get out. Get out. You can't even do anything. You're a shameless. Get out of my room. You can't do anything. You cannot do anything. 30 minutes now. Two minutes now. Just get out. Three days, woman. Get out, yes. Three days, woman. Get out. Why are you a woman? I'll call police for you if you don't get out of the room. Get out. Oh, wow. This one shocked me. <laughs> yeah, who's there? Hold on. Who's that? Hey. Um. I came to finish what was started. What? What was started? Oh my god, what did you start? Oh my god, you are so sexy. Hey, 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 hey. Stop. I've told you we, we can't do this, alright? I am in love with your friend, Mimi. She's not my friend, she's just my flatmate. Okay, I am in love with your flatmate, alright? This is not right. Let, let's. Come on, Jamie. Shanna, stop, stop. I love what I'm seeing. Stop, okay? Please. Come on, Shanna, stop it. Stop. What's wrong with you? What is wrong with you? I said I'm in love with your flatmate. But why, why are you doing this? This is what you want. Ah! Somebody help! Somebody! Somebody help me! He wants to rape me! He tried to rape me! Oh my god! Help me! Somebody help me! He tried to rape me! So I only 
went in there to talk to him and then to tell him that we can't see each other anymore since he is now with Mimi. And then I just got in there and didn't know what he did to me. That's a lie. Enough with the lies, Shana. I've had enough of it. What are you talking about? You were blinded by whatever you feel for that guy over me, your friend. Look at what I'm passing through. Shana, you are such a bloody liar. What do you gain from these lies? Femi is not in love with you. He has nothing to do with you. He has never had anything with you. Yes. I overheard you guys the other day in your room. You were cajoling him. You were trying to force him into getting down with you, but he refused. He blatantly refused and you kept trying, yet he refused. Shana, you came out all mushy, lovey-dovey, pretending that everything was okay with you guys and you were an item. Why? Of course I had to pretend. I knew it was all a lie, but I played along. After all, we all have been faking it, right? All this while, I knew everything that has been going on between the both of you. You know you're a very terrible person. What you did tonight is the height of it. Why would you accuse a young innocent man of rape just because he rejected you? Why? What do you stand to gain if you ruin his reputation? Yes, satisfaction. I would be satisfied to know that you don't have him either. When Femi came to this apartment, we were close. I fell in love with him immediately I saw him. You, you know what? You are a pretender. You are such a bloody liar, Mimi. You acted like you were disgusted by his sight and that you couldn't stand his air. Then all of a sudden you come here to tell us you're now in love with him. Even after I told you I was in love with him. How was I supposed to know you were in love with him? How? After everything I heard upstairs, I knew there was nothing between the both of you. Then why didn't you give me the chance to make him fall in love with me? You decided to make him fall in I love with you. Decide to make him fall in love with me. Shana, I fell in love with Femi from the very moment I set my eyes on him. I want to believe I was the first person to set eyes on that guy when he moved into this apartment, right? Yes, I threw tantrums. I made us fight here and there, but that was only because I was trying to shield my feelings towards him. I was scared. I didn't want him to know I was in love with him. But yes, I loved that man from the first day that I met him. And I am sorry, but I do love him. You're sorry? Mimi, you were sorry? If you think I am a devil, then you are a bigger devil. You stole my man! I did not steal your man. He was never yours. He was never yours. I am just a loner. But I wouldn't give it up for you to see. I just need a lover. I just need a place for me to be. I love. I need it, but I won't make it all Yes, I'm sure. I'll just go over to my family place and stay until I'm able to get a place. I don't want to cause trouble for you and Femi. You won't cause us any troubles, Shannon. Mimi, let's just avoid it, okay? I don't trust myself, but I bear no grudges against you, honestly, and we're still friends. 
thank you so much. You have such a kind heart. Thank you. I miss you so much. Yeah. I miss you. <laughs> Take care of my friend. But my heart keeps beating in the same direction. Oh no, no. What could I have done? So I put on pretense to boost my presence. So when I'm upset, they will feel I belong. I put on pretense. To boost my presence So when I'm absent They will feel I belong But there is nothing inside of me But I know that you feel The same way that I feel I know that you know The same thing that I know So what now? You just made me lose a friend I'm sorry about that. Well, we are sorry love isn't enough. I you know I have better love, ways of apologizing, but right? I can say Which is... Your face. Oh, come with me and I'll show you. Ah, uh, you are so spoiled. Come on. What yeah. exactly do you want to show me? I am just a loner. <laughs> but I wouldn't give it up for you to see. I just need a lover I just need a place for me to be This kind of love I need it but I won't make it obvious Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah This kind of life I'm lonely but I won't make it obvious Ooh, ooh. So I know that you feel The same thing that I feel I know that you know The same thing that I know We are love foes We are love foes Oh, we are love foes We are love foes Oh They didn't tell me how to run this race I thought I